I want to welcome uh, the congressional leadership here and thank them for their time. Uh, I think we're all aware that we have uh, some urgent business to do. We've got to make sure that taxes don't go up on middle class families, that uh, our economy remains strong, that we're creating jobs. Uh, and that's an agenda that Democrats and Republicans and independents, uh, people all across the country share. So our challenge is to make sure that uh, you know, we are able to cooperate together, work together, uh, find some common ground, uh, make some tough compromises, build some consensus uh, to do the people's business. Uh, and what the folks are looking for, uh, and I think all of us agree on this, is action. They want to see that we are focused on them, uh, not focused on uh, our politics here in Washington. So uh, my hope is, is that uh, this is going to be the beginning of a a fruitful process uh, where we're able to come to an agreement that will reduce our deficit uh, in a balanced uh, way, that we will deal with some of these long-term impediments to growth, uh, and we're also uh, going to be focusing on making sure that middle-class families uh, are able to get ahead. Uh, so I want to thank all the leadership for coming, and uh, with that, uh, we're going to get to work. Thank you very much, everybody. Appreciate it. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, uh, excuse me. There, there, there's actually one other point that I wanted to make, uh, and that is that uh, my understanding is uh, tomorrow's Speaker Boehner's birthday. So for those of you who want to uh, wish him a happy birthday, uh, we will, uh, we're not going to embarrass him with a cake because we, we didn't know how many candles were needed. Uh, but, uh, yeah, right. But, right. but we do want to wish him a happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thank you, everybody. Thank you.